whether you're looking to disconnect before the holiday madness, have fun while shopping, or experience holiday hotspots before the crowds roll in, there are some pre-holiday escapes you can visit. Travel expert Janine Tornator joins us now with more. Thanks for being here. Great to be here as always. Because if I'm, am I right that the week before Christmas is really like cheap time of year to go, like right now? Well, aside from the week of Thanksgiving and then right Sorry, over yes. between yeah. Christmas and New Year's, December can actually be a pretty great time to travel. The week after Thanksgiving, like that Monday after when everyone's come home, sure. yeah, nice time to get away. Okay. Yeah, because okay. everyone's coming back. The kids are getting back in school for a couple of weeks, so sure. demand does start to drop during those weeks in between. Okay, so, okay. so you yes. get some great deals out there. You can, you can. So let's start with a drive destination. Okay. I actually okay. had a lot of people asking me, like, from Chicago, are there any drive destinations where you can kind of have that, you know, nice Christmas getaway? The Lake Geneva is my pick. I think a lot of people think of Lake Geneva as a summer destination, yeah. which is a great mm -hmm. summer destination, but it can be really great during the winter months as well. I mean, you have such a quaint little downtown, mm -hmm. nice place to go, do some holiday shopping. They have their Harbor Trail, which is around the lake. So if you get some like warmer, mild days, that can be a nice outdoor activity as well. Yeah. And then um, the place to stay here, I really love the Grand Geneva. Okay. It's a true resort and they have so many things to do here. It's great for couples. It's great for a girlfriend getaway. I just did one there last month oh, for fun. one mm -hmm. night, and it was perfect. Oh, and we it's really there. great for yeah. families. Yeah, so the they mm -hmm. have, you know, great restaurants, seasonal menus, seasonal cocktails. So you have mm -hmm. all of that fun stuff to experience. They have a wonderful spa. They have a great big lobby with a fireplace and a big, nice oh, bar. Nice. They have fire pits outside. Um, and like you were seeing here, they have their Timber Ridge Lodge, which is mm -hmm. sort of a sister lodge, which is great for families because they have a wonderful indoor That's water amazing. park there. Mm -hmm. So that can be fun so all fun. winter long. But also during the Christmas holiday season, um, they have a great um, ski hill. So mm -hmm. if you want to take the kids out and like learn to ski, it's a great place to do it. They have ice skating, um, and you're seeing here a lot of their Christmas things. So they cool. have their 12 days of Christmas drive-through light show with over two million Christmas lights. They have their gingerbread house walk, breakfast with Santa. You can mm. take trolley tours. You can even get Christmas trees put in your room if you're going to stay there over the holidays. Oh, so so it's one of just those really great traditional family getaways. It's 90 minutes from downtown. Chicago so super easy to get away I did it on a girlfriend getaway this fall just for one night That's and fun. that was actually it was perfect good. yeah but yeah the longer you can stay the better because there's just so many things to do there that's really right. cute okay so a little bit further away Yes, the Caribbean. Well, <laughs> everyone is already thinking, where am I going to get warm. away warm this winter? Warm weather escapes. And of course, the Caribbean is always a hot spot over the holiday season. So mm -hmm. I wanted to talk about that and how can you do that in an affordable way? And I know I've talked about this on here before, but right now, because the Caribbean airfare is so expensive to get to some of these island destinations, yeah. a cruise is really your best value in doing it. I actually found a lot of airfare into Miami, um, Orlando, Jacksonville, Tampa, some of those Florida ports where there's a lot of great cruise ships mm -hmm. in December for $200 or less as long as you're willing to fly on the off-peak day. So not heading out like the week of Thanksgiving, right. but maybe go like we're talking about that first week in December sure. or again before those Christmas crowds come. But you're saying Carnival Cruise Line, they have cruises that are four-day cruises of the Eastern and Western Caribbean that start at $125. What? Get four out. dates in December. Oh so gosh. you can do it really affordably. Go into one of those airports, get a decent airfare, and then get out on some of these cruise ships. And you're actually seeing right here the newest carnival ship called the Celebration, which actually launches its maiden voyage next week, the week of Thanksgiving, from their <laughs> so new cute. terminal in Miami. It's their newest Excel class ship. Um, it's doing Eastern, Eastern and Western um, Caribbean routes. They have a roller coaster on board. They have these six, six so themed fun. zones. Yeah. These newer ships, and this ship holds over 5,000 oh guests. So you can imagine there's a lot of cabins to fill. So that's why you can get some of these really good rates. And there probably won't be any kids on there either. So right. that make it even better. Might not be if you go when they're still in school. Yeah. Right. Right, exactly. Yes. <laughs> All right, we're, we're running out of time. Scottsdale, Arizona? Yeah, so if, another thing, if you're looking for a warm weather escape, nice mild weather, is think about these desert destinations. Mm -hmm. In Scottsdale, they actually call December their secret season. It's when, um, you know, the lodging capacity is a little, they have more there. So you're going to find a lot of great promotions at some of the really nice resorts and hotels. They have their Scott's Dazzle celebration, which takes place in downtown Scottsdale. Lots of fun events. Um, also, they have Christmas at the Princess. This is the Fairmont Scottsdale Princess. 
and it's like a destination in itself during the holiday season. They have an outdoor ice skating rink. So they cute. have fire pits. There's so much going on here. Millions and millions of lights. But these yeah. desert destinations can be really nice because they're not busy this time of year. Really? Um, the temperatures are really mild to do a lot of the great outdoor things there as well. All really right. quick before I let you go, pack and go. This sounds like a great idea. Yes, so I wanted to put this on here because I think it's a really fun idea. Yeah. Like, look, if you're too busy to plan a trip or you want to just do something different and spontaneous, there is this company called Pack Up and Go. They literally curate, plan, and book your trip for you, and you don't know where you're going until a couple of days before. Oh. My girlfriend and I were talking about doing this for a girlfriend yeah. getaway in the new year. So basically, you set your budget. You say, here's the budget I want to spend. And then you go online and you do the survey where you talk about your interests, what your travel history is, like the kind of things you like to do. And then a week before, you get a preparation email that says, like, here's the, how you need to dress for the weather and this kind of thing. And then a couple of days before, you get your surprise envelope in the mail. You open it up. It tells you where you're going. That's so cool. And they, okay. do, they do plane trips, train, road trips. You need about three weeks out to start the okay. process to do this. But, yeah, their website's packupgo.com. And I just think it's a that's really fun thing to do. Cool like, give, give yourself a Christmas gift yeah. of a surprise that trip, right? Wow, that is fun. That on a train. I know. Yeah, I like yeah. That. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, Janine. All right. Great My ideas pleasure. as always. The outside, uh, the outside Insiders are our social media handles and our website as well. Check her out. Janine, thank you. Happy holidays. Yeah. Happy holidays.